No matter how the golden days of autumn are celebrated at your house, chances are at some point you'll be carving a pumpkin. I'm wearing my surgical gloves because it is kind of like surgery. <laughs> if you want it to look good by Halloween, you can't carve it too early. However, you can make your cut pumpkins last much longer by taking two steps. One, take a mixture of bleach and water and spray all the cut surfaces of your pumpkin. When dry, swipe some petroleum jelly on the cut surfaces as a barrier to fungus and bacteria. Here's a safe way to light your jack-o'-lantern that won't require a candle or matches. What you want to do, carve an extra hole in the back of your pumpkin right there, big enough for a plug to fit through. Then what you do is you drop in a string of 50 Christmas lights, pull that plug through, plug it in, and that jack-o'-lantern will burn all night long. Those cute little pumpkins can make more than pie. When cleaned and baked, they can make a perfect bowl for your favorite stew, soup, maybe pumpkin bisque. Or how about a dip made with pepitas, the inside of the pumpkin seed? Food expert Robin Bensley has a healthy option with ground pepitas, salt, cayenne, coriander, lime juice. Some tomato paste. Okay. And my favorite ingredient, water. <laughs> okay. Really, you just add water until it's a good dipping consistency. And here is perhaps the best news of all about eating.